Today we will be testing the EDRI Extreme Points Buy and Sell Indicator. Before we do, if you have not watched the first videos on the channel and the videos after that, you need to go do that now. Here at the Academy of Forex, we are building the best trading system possible as a team. You can find a link down below to sign up for TradingView. If you use that link, you'll save a little bit of money on your account. You can also find a link below to join us on Discord. If you are interested in a full list of all the indicators and strategies that we have tested along with their win rates, you can sign up for our Patreon. And you will receive a full list of all the indicators and strategies that we have tested. You can find a link to our Patreon down below in the description. We also have a Patreon-only exclusive Discord channel where we will give you a list of winning indicators, a list of winning strategies, post-trade ideas, give advanced advice, and much more. So click the link below to join our Patreon. Alright, as I said today, we will be testing the EDRI Extreme Points Buy and Sell Indicator. Before we do though, I wanted to put the testing scoreboard up for everyone to see. So to date, we have tested a total of 90 different strategies, with 27 of them being winners. The best one so far was able to achieve an 84% win rate. We've also tested a total of 906 indicators with 378 of them being winners. The best ones so far were able to achieve a 100% win rate. Now you need to go back and watch those videos to understand the context of how they were able to achieve that. So go back and watch those videos and see what you can get out of those winning indicators. We've also retested in the advanced testing 102 indicators. 36 of them have been able to maintain the winning status, the best two, a 76% win rate. Now keep in mind that we test most of these strategies and indicators on the Forex and crypto market, but they can be applied to just about any market and time frame universally. All right, so today we're testing the EDRI Extreme Points Buy and Sell Indicator. And so the indicator itself on default basically just gives these arrows here. I know they're pretty small and hard to see, even if we zoom in on them, uh, they do not get larger like the candles do. And so unfortunately, we're kind of stuck with them at this size, but you can see the red arrow here. If I scroll back a little bit, you can see a green arrow here and so on back and back. And so, like I said, on default, this is how it looks here. You can go into the setting and you can uh, check that little box there. This is plot mean reversion bands on chart. And then you can see now uh, we have some bands here um, that you could uh, put on screen and display those as well. But what we're looking for essentially is those uh, arrows there. And so those are going to be our buy and sell uh, signals or buy and sell arrows and so when we get a red arrow that's going to be a signal to go short when we get a green arrow that's going to be a signal to go long and so uh, not much to it other than that let's go ahead and get on with the testing and see what we can get out of it So the first signal that we pick up is a buy signal. You can see that we get that green arrow right there. And pretty much immediately we start to uh, get this pressure to the downside and it pulls back just far enough uh, to stop us out before it does finally roll uh, under there and start to push back to the upside. But this one is going to uh, get stopped out there. So let's go ahead and continue on.
All right, so the next signal that we pick up is a sell signal, a short signal. Again, you can see we get that red arrow right there. We get a little bit of a push back to the upside right here. See me uh, kind of measure that out a few times just to make sure it didn't hit our stop because it got really close to it, but it did just barely avoid it before it then rolls over and pushes down. It does give us another sell signal right here, but of course we were already in the first one. And so we ignored that one, but that one does come down and get us to our take profit. So what I'm going to do now is go ahead and fast forward through the rest of the testing that way things don't get too long and we'll pick this up when we're at the end of the year. All right, so that puts us at the end of the testing right there. Before we take a look at what this was able to achieve, if you are looking for a profitable trading strategy, I highly suggest you check out the best strategy that we have tested on the channel here. It was able to achieve an 84% win rate. I'll put a screenshot up of the uh, thumbnail to that video right now. I'll link to it up in the corner and I'll also link to it at the end of this video with that same thumbnail. Like I said, it is a highly profitable trading strategy, was able to achieve an 84% win rate. It uses one of our custom indicators that we've developed here on the channel as well as a trading view indicator and all around it is a wonderful trading strategy. I highly recommend you check that out. Another thing that we're doing here recently that we've been working on for a while is an automated trading strategy. Uh, we have successfully automated a strategy in partnership with Mike from Upright Trading. It's a strategy that he has developed and then I spent uh, quite a few hours and days and weeks kind of dialing in the uh, settings and setting up all the automation on it. It's currently running on a live test uh, forward test on a demo account. And here in the near future, we will be picking a couple handfuls of patrons from the Discord server to uh, help with the live testing on a demo account just to work out any bugs or kinks before we release it to everyone else and so there is a lot of benefits to becoming a patron of the channel i highly recommend it all right so let's go ahead and take a look at our indicator here scroll this back a little bit all right so we're pretty clear here so we have one two three four and five trades all together and only one winning trade and so unfortunately this is not going to meet the 60 percent criteria that we were looking for uh, it did seem like there were moments where it was doing pretty well catching kind of pretty close to the bottom here right at the top here um kind of close to the top here um does look like it caught the top here so there are moments that like i said i feel like it did really well and so uh maybe using this um just to um kind of work with some other indicators might be the way to go uh instead of using this as a um, entry indicator just maybe as a confirmation indicator kind of some secondary indicators on screen to just kind of confirm the overall uh, bias of a particular system might be the way to go with this. I do feel like, again, it was catching some pretty decent moves at some times. And so um, definitely don't want to ignore an indicator that can catch uh, these highs and lows uh, pretty decent. And so uh, I do think, again, might be some uh, validity to throw this on screen and play around with it with an existing system and so but for now unfortunately this one is going to go on our no list and we'll move on to the next indicator from here